At the heart of our bottom-up transformation agenda is the endeavor to radically increase employment opportunities and simultaneously significantly enhance the productivity of labor in five priority sectors. Without a doubt, our interventions to transform agriculture are fundamental to the successful implementation of the plan. One of the drivers of the high cost of living and high levels of poverty especially in rural areas, is that agricultural productivity has stagnated. Even as our population rose, consequently, our food production more often than not falls below demand, and the importation of food increases our trade, uh, trade deficit and increases food prices. Given that food constitutes up to 54% of household expenditure, agricultural productivity is therefore a very high priority. At the same time, agriculture contributes 70% of employment of our population. Low productivity contributes to low earnings in the agricultural sector and undermines the capacity of households to withstand the cost of living, deepening poverty. Further, Agriculture contributes 25% to our GDP directly and another 25% indirectly, a total of 50%. Low productivity responsible for deficit in essential agricultural produce is responsible for high importation, which depletes our foreign exchange and deepens the negative trade balance, worsening economic situations everywhere. Very few sectors of our economy have endured as much shock and stress as agriculture on account of extreme weather events, erratic climate, and the other adverse impacts of climate change. Our nation and our region has just emerged from a devastating spell of drought, which lasted for six seasons, leaving behind a catastrophic trail of famine, undernourishment, loss of crops and livestock, disrupted livelihoods, increased poverty, and weakened resilience. Yet we are not here to talk about all that is negative, especially when the prospects of a turnaround are so clear before us. This overview is intended to be a contextual backdrop of the opportunities that exist for local and international investors to direct capital and technology into agriculture and agro-industrial manufacturing in order to set out 
our economy on a path of transformation.